Virgo, welcome to my channel. I'm the Soul Teacher. I'm here today to do your waxing moon phase reading. We just stepped into this phase today. I'm sorry I'm a little bit late. The waxing moon phase is the is the time where the full oh sorry, where the moon becomes a little bit bigger every night um, until it is actually full. So we need to focus during this time on whatever goals and manifestations that we want to be done by the full moon. So let's see what is your overall energy for this period, Virgo. And we have soul family. Call in your tribe. You don't have to do it alone. Um, I'm busy working on other readings that I'm going to do for you guys. And with, specifically with Virgo, um, it was interesting that the question came up, um, why do I need to ask others for help? So obviously this is a Virgo thing. <laughs> um, you need you need to call in your soul tribe, Virgo. You need to do the these things. We're not alone. We are standing with our light family, with our soul family. So we really do. You need to ask for help when you feel you need it. Even even if you don't feel you need it, maybe you should still ask for help. <laughs> Let's see what Luna has to say for you. I just want to cut the deck. Just a few more shuffles and we can see, oh gosh, that was a bit of a spill. Okay, Virgo, what is rising up in you between now and the full moon? The solution to any challenges you might face right now, advice and the final outcome. Okay, so what is rising, rising up between now and the full moon? Don't let your past hold you back. You are going towards a brand new life. You cannot look back on your past. Do not let your past hold you back. You are ready to let your past be just that, your past. The solution to challenges, communication is key. New moon in Gemini. This is really, really important. Virgo, um, if you don't communicate to other people, they also won't know that you need help. So communication is kind of vital in your situation right now, I feel. Your advice is it's a time for healing. And how am I going to heal? By asking others to help me. Virgo, ask for help. Your final outcome is look at the bigger picture. With all of these difficulties happening in your life, with all of these weird things happening in your life, with all of the chaos, there was, is a bigger picture to look at where it becomes the full picture, where the, the, the lucky Sagittarius, the happy, joyous Sagittarius is in the works for you. You will, with all of the, the hardships that you've been going through, this is all gonna change. It had a purpose, it has a purpose. So look at the bigger picture and see why things have been going haywire in your life. Okay. Let's see what the angels have to say. Thank you, angels, for your guidance. Please, can we see what you want to add to this reading for Virgo for the, ooh, there we go, waxing moon period. Wow. It's time to stop fighting, Virgo, and time to just be peaceful. Peaceful warrior, Archangel Ariel. Thank you, Ariel, for helping me stand my ground with peace. Because when you fight, then your energy is out of balance. When you're at peace, you come into alignment, which means that your manifestations can ground so much quicker in your reality. Okay, Virgo, I hope you have a great waxing moon period. I'll see you on the flip side.